when things are obviously when we was getting busy and whatnot because mm. uh, a lot of people buying new clothes new this no that i was buying <laughs> left right center now burying yeah. them all over do you know what i'm trying to say uh, you know you think you know you could be anyone anyone can come for you you it doesn't matter who you are in it yeah someone from a different manner can come with you and you're finished do you know what i'm trying to say it doesn't matter how big or bad you are everyone bleeds so, so for me yeah so for me that's that's what i was building up like everyone in my manner knows straight away that like if, if they've got a slight thought Let's do something to him. They know right, but then he's got something right there, or something's gonna happen. Do you know what I'm saying? So you're kind of known for it as well. Did you say? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah right, if, right, right. If, if, if you're gonna think of something, you're gonna do someone's homework. Yeah, yeah. First yeah. thing you're gonna ask, right, who he's connected to. So either way, that, that that's actually just a game over, isn't it? Like mm. when you find out, like in terms of my my circles and that, it's a thing. And you think, all right, forget forget that's one thing. But then you think, all right, what if there wasn't around one day, everyone was on holiday or something? Yeah, then you yeah, think, yeah. Fuck, he's got some serious serious things around him. And to be fair, that's what, that's what made me who I am. Yeah. Even today, like, you've got to protect yourself fiercely. Because you never know what's coming. Like I said, people can come down with, like I said, people got loads of things. So for me, luckily, that's, that's what I invested my things in. Now, how many would you have at one time? Just the maximum, allegedly. Yeah, it, it just depends. It's all different shapes and sizes. <laughs> it just depends, isn't it? Where you got to have you a pick scat- a mix, yeah? Uh, yeah, that's what I was, it's pick a mix, man. Like, yeah. I realize, like, you got to realize, I'm just a skinny five foot five guy. Mm. What's, what's going to matter about a big tonk inch guy from, I don't know, from the, from the ghetto? Nothing. You're just, a, you're, just a, you're just a body. But then at least I know I'm giving myself a half chance. So you're coming through that, like, do you know what I'm saying? It, it, it's, it's, do you know what I'm saying? It's game over. Mm. Um, and then, like I said, I met, I met some serious brothers along the way that had some other serious stuff. I don't want to say too much. Yeah. Again, it's going to get me, like, like I said, put it this way. I could, if I really wanted to, if I got the brothers together from everywhere, we could cause a scene like Gaza. Facts. Mm. Do you know what I'm saying? Facts. My, my guys are ready anytime, wherever. But do you know what? A lot of the time, we're, a lot of it's come down to brotherhood. We're, we're not about all of that life. Do you know what I'm saying? We go to the mosque, we're on our deen, we all got our children. Um, but if you come for our children, come for any of us like that for no reason, then it's a whole different story. So what, what kind of change? Is it just growing up or...? Um, so again, like through the lifestyle. Yeah. I, like I said, I was born Muslim, a strict Muslim, but growing up in my younger, to be fair, I, I, I drank, mm. I did drugs, um, and I never got peace. I never got peace. Because with that lifestyle, you've got to understand, if I like to go in Knightsbridge and that, with a party with the big boys, like, it ruins your mindset. Right. And then you think, a lot of nowadays, half the population is on drinking drugs. Yeah. So for me, I realised, you know what, it, it ruined my life. Like, I was thinking, obviously I didn't get that, but for me, I was never that guy that sold his stuff, was always in there. I never owed anyone a penny. Mm. Do you know what I'm trying to say? Um, but I always wanted nice stuff, so I never let myself go. Like a lot of people, that lifestyle, you have a guy in jail, you have a guy in dead, or you're going to turn into a nitty. Do you know what I'm mm. saying? Luckily for me, Alhamdulillah, I was none of them. But I had personal expectations. Yeah. Um, so I would never let myself go for that. Um, so the change was, obviously, I would never get peace. I never had no peace, obviously. And then I one day I thought, you know what? Like, I need to start changing my life, see what happens. My mum and dad used to go to the mosque, go thingy Friday. And then I had little things. I remember... One day, I remember, I didn't, at one time, I didn't have a pot to piss in. Mm. My pal was doing a little raffle. Like, back on social media, so I'd predict some numbers and whatever. And me and the missus were just sitting in bed. I was like, oh, we have to pay our rent and stuff. I was like, oh, fuck, what am I going to do, it? Yeah. yeah. And I was like, Allah, if you're real, please give me, let me, give me the number. I? Anyway, I had like 300 left in my account, 300 quid. Yeah. 100 quid I paid to this guy. I won the raffle. Yeah. Ah. And then I was like, nah, this could be luck. I said, Allah. Please, just one more time. I won the raffle. But then I, I didn't even, I didn't go to prayers then. I was like, yeah, I was just still, I was arrogant. I was like, yeah, whatever. And I just carried on living. And then it was, it got to the point, I really wanted this Range Rover. I was mm. like, ah, oh, nice. No, all my, my favourite car. I wanted it. I said, Allah, please, I will do everything. I got it. So I thought, you know what? Three times I done what I done. I thought, let me go to the mosque. Let me see what it's about. Yeah. Um, and, I start, and then I started going there. I started going there a lot. And I could see little changes. I could see little changes in life. Um, then I had issues with my children's mother, mm. um, mothers, and I got two kids, moms, and that. Um, and then to be fair, all that children not seeing your children drove me mad. Absolutely yeah. drove me mad. Um, to be fair, there was one point I didn't want to be. I was, to be fair, 